Help fight Islamic terrorism. Visit www.americansagainsthate.org. My name is Joe Kaufman. I'm the chairman of Americans Against Hate and an investigative journalist for Front Page Magazine, Mayor Fisher Commission. On the night of December 15, 2010, I took part in a protest outside the Islamic Center of South Florida, located in Pompano Beach, Florida, because the center was holding an event, a fundraiser, featuring British activist George Galloway as, a, as the speaker. Galloway never showed up to the event because the U.S. government disallowed him from entering the United States. The reason for this was probably due to the fact that Galloway is a known fundraiser for the terrorist organization Hamas, and in the United States, it is illegal to provide material support to Hamas. In March 2009, Galloway, following a large fundraising drive, stated while in Gaza City, quote, whatever we brought, we will give. Tomorrow Allah, willing, tomorrow, Allah willing, at 10 o'clock in the morning, we will give all our vehicles, our keys, our aid, our money to Ishmael Hania, the elected prime minister of Palestine, end quote. Ishmael Hania is the head of Hamas in Gaza. Well, it turns out Galloway did speak at the Pompano Mosque fundraiser, not in person, but over a live internet feed. While I was outside the center, I took video footage of an attendee to the fundraiser, standing with who appeared to be his three young sons, who identified himself as a member of Hezbollah. Hezbollah, like Hamas, is listed on the U.S. State Department's list of foreign terrorist organizations. I have this individual on video stating in Hebrew, and there's a word I cannot say here, quote, Hezbollah is going to expletive you, and you're not going to know how, end quote. I'm going to provide each of you a copy of a video showing this individual making this statement. Now, uh, previously, I had stood here and explained to you how this Islamic center was owned by the North American Islamic Trust, or NATE, and how that group was named by the U.S. Justice Department as a party to the financing of millions of dollars to Hamas. That information is also on this disk. As well, I explained to you how the imam of the center, Hassan Sabri, is on record referring to America as an enemy and how Sabri had previously stated his wishes for Allah to rid Jerusalem of all its Jews. Now I ask you, isn't all of this enough to put a halt to the new mosque that you, the Pompano City Commission, gave this center the permit to build? Isn't all of this enough to rescind the permit? I ask these questions because I know that given all of the evidence against this group, it is my estimation that this mosque will be a threat to the city and to our nation in general. Once again, I ask you to do the right thing and shut this project down. Thank you for giving me this time to speak with you. Please do the right thing. Major Knowles, Major Knowles, would you get with Mr. Hoffman and provide the Homeland Security measures and, and also get a copy of that as well so you can guide him in the right directions too. Thank you. Can I give these to you? You can give the city clerk and she'll give them to us later. Okay. Thank you. Help fight Islamic terrorism. Visit www.americansagainsthate.org.